Patrick Duhaney, who dismantled bombs in the military, delivered a bombshell to his bosses today. In the midst of a pandemic and police reform protests, he's been hired to do in Virginia Beach what he's been doing here for 18 months, manage the city. Mayor John Cranley, on this bittersweet moment. Virginia Beach, I'm happy for them. Uh, they have a tremendous leader coming their way, but I'm sad for us. Duhaney's respectful, efficient, steady style is something lawmakers have appreciated. They speak of how he worked without any quest for limelight at City Hall, motivated by a mission to public service as its own reward. These past several weeks, we've gotten so close, you know, to bring the city through the pandemic, the budget issues, and the social unrest. His departure dovetails with the city's most difficult budget in the modern era, one he will shepherd to conclusion before leaving for Virginia Beach. And he was just incredibly gifted at always shooting straight, um, always being honest. I don't think he got any sleep for several days during the protest, so there's been a lot on his plate, and uh, he's done an excellent job. City solicitor Paula Boggs Muthing will be the city's interim manager come late July. Duhaney is already working on the transition. City leaders are working on getting used to the fact that he's not going to be around. I really mean it when I say that I have never worked with a manager uh, uh, who has been as effective as Patrick. Little known example of that in January, Mayor Cranley says, long before the pandemic was on anyone's radar, Patrick Duhaney had his procurement officers call China from midnight to 8 a.m. repeatedly to stock up on PPE because he sensed that it could be critical. Reporting live, City Hall, John London, WWT News 5. Yeah.